When humans first arrived on Aotearoa, New Zealand, about 800 and 900 years ago, there were nine species of the dinosaur-sized giant birds. It's one of the only birds ever known that has no wings at all. Their existence was almost mythological. It's estimated that there were probably 150,000 giant mowers walking around. Within the first 150 years of human presence, all nine species became extinct. We really need to have a look at what's happened in the past and now look towards the, the future. The story of the moa, there's a very interesting background and back history of uh, Māori ancestral interactions with the animal. The idea that we could see one again, return it back to the ecosystem, work with the Māori and bring back this animal that has a cultural heritage here, it's almost overwhelming. I'm pretty stoked about this partnership. It's going to involve both a big conservation project, biobanking, local species, including birds that are endangered. What's great about de-extinction is it acts as this engine to drive conservation action that benefits not just the moa, but all native species in New Zealand. Once we're able to harness that technology of actually creating more birds or cloning birds, it can be applied to a whole slew of conservation projects. And eventually, bringing the moa back to life. We really want this to be a Maori-led initiative, and I'm really excited that we're able to do that here. It's going to be undoubtable ramifications for the conservation work that we're involved with. It's really their vision, really putting the Maori first. This isn't the scientists telling the indigenous people what to do. It's a complete partnership. What I've heard over the last two days fills me with hope. Empowering. Hope is restored. Peter's a visionary. He always held his dream. We're now at the point where being extinct isn't really the end of the story. So, so we don't want to release moa into the wild, and we don't want to put them into zoos. So we want to be able to give the moa you know, a natural environment as big as we possibly can. The moa inspires the imagination.